Well, lucky me. <laughs> dead battery. Uh, well, it's not dead, but it tried to turn over but wouldn't start. So, anyway, I got this uh, battery jump start kit that I purchased uh, at Christmas. And we're going to test it out, see if it works the way it should. I'm crossing my fingers because I'm stranded. Luckily, I'm not in the woods somewhere. I'm at work, so I got others that I can call on if I need to. But let's see if this thing works. I'm going to pull it out and see what we got and see how to use it and plug it in and give it a go. Here we go. All right, well, here it is. Got the Gulu. 2000 amp uh, jump starter It's the Titan series. Let's see how this thing works uh, 9.0 liter maximum gas engine capacity uh, I'm in the six range so I should be good there uh, I gotta pull it out here and I did charge it so hopefully It's still holding the charge after a couple weeks and get this thing open there we go all right let's see what we got here okay comes in a nice pouch all right what we got here that's a baggie with all the chargers and everything get out of the deal here let me get my reading glasses on and see what the heck I'm doing here. It says caution, fully charged before use. All right, it says caution, fully charged before use. Do not dismantle device, blah, 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 blah. Okay. Let's take that off. Let's see what we got to do here. Okay, don't attempt to charge. Don't overcharge. Don't blah, blah, blah. Okay, we need to get the instructions out and see what we're doing. Okay. Do not, do not, do not. Okay. All right. All right, in the bag with the charging unit, it's the instruction manual, the charger to charge it with the wall, and jumper cables, red and black. And the jumper cables, red and black for the polarity and this plugs in to the side of the unit so let's do that open up the side door here that's where the jumper cables go in it's only one way it fits all right looks like I got a full charge right here let's read the instructions find out how to actually use it and then we will Proceed to hook it up to the battery in the truck and see what we do with it. All right, what it says here is to connect the battery cables to the charging device. Make sure two indicators on the jumper cable is off. Connect the red clamp to the positive on the battery. Connect the black to the black. Check the indicator light on the jumper cable to make sure green light on and solid. You can start the truck. Red light and beeping means something's wrong. You need to do the uh, reconnection. Let's give that a go. See how it works. All right. Let's get the positive on the positive. Okay. Let me get the 
negative on the negative over here. And we've got a green light saying we're good to go. Means we've got a good connection. Let's go give it a try, see if it starts. Hopefully the phone won't fall on the engine when I start it. Here we go. And started right up. So let's unplug this and let's uh, turn it off. Okay. Just press and hold that and shut it off. Oh, that's the light. We don't need any of that. Okay. I think it'll shut off on its own. All right. <laughs> Saved my bacon. We got this thing uh, worked out great. So it started my truck the way it's supposed to. Now I can head down to the repair shop and get a new battery. And if it dies again in the parking lot at the repair shop while I'm getting a battery, I can use it again because I know it works. And there's many of them out there. This just happens to be the Gulu Gulu brand that I bought on Amazon. So it was pretty affordable and had good reviews. So this is the one I purchased. Anyway, it worked and I'm happy because it's cold outside and I didn't want to have to walk home. Yeah, I love it when uh, being prepared actually works out for once. Heck yeah. I purchased that uh, battery charger so that I could have it in the truck for when we're off on some remote trailhead somewhere and I get a dead battery and nobody's around. So I got that uh, charger for that purpose, but it actually ended up uh, helping me out in town. Even though I could have asked uh, somebody for a jump start with a, one of their cars, um, decided to use this unit it worked out great so it's good to know that this unit will work while I'm off in the back country down some remote trailhead or some forest road somewhere so that peace of mind of being prepared and having the extra gear there to help you out of those situations it's great to have so I'm excited it worked out